Notebook LM quietly crossed a really important milestone. It is now officially built on Gemini 3. And while that might sound like a backend upgrade, it actually changes what this product is capable of. Notebook LM is no longer just a tool that helps you read and summarize documents. It is starting to collapse the entire workflow from research to creation in a single place. In this video, I want to show you what that looks exactly like in practice. So let's get into it. Gemini 3 brings stronger reasoning, better structure, and much more multimodal understanding. But the most important part is not the model itself. It is how Notebook LM is now using that intelligence. Instead of stopping at summaries or notes, Notebook LM is starting to turn research into usable outputs, like slides, visuals, and structured narratives. The goal is no longer just understanding information. The goal is turning that understanding into something you can actually present or share. That shift is what everything else in this video builds on. One of the most important updates is that Notebook LM is now integrated into the Gemini app. You can add your notebooks by clicking on the plus icon here, then selecting Notebook LM and selecting the specific notebook you would want to add to Gemini. The exact details of how notebook imports will work long term are still evolving, and this feature is clearly still in development. Google has not finalized every capability yet, and that is worth being upfront about. But even in its current form, the direction here is very clear. You can now attach Notebook LM notebooks directly inside Gemini and work with them there. That means your research, your notes, and your sources can travel with you into Gemini without manual copying or context loss. For professionals and researchers who already rely on Notebook LM to manage their structured information, this is a big deal. It removes friction between tools and makes it much easier to move from research into reasoning and creation. Let me show you what this looks like on screen. Here inside the Gemini app, I can add an existing Notebook LM notebook. So I'm going to select the plus icon, click on Notebook LM, and add my large language model concepts and mechanism notebook here, which is basically a notebook about how LLMs work and how the key concepts and mechanisms flow with each other. So I'm going to click on that. I'm going to add that here. And then I can ask the model using the attached Notebook LM notebook, summarize the key ideas and explain how they connect to each other. Now, what's really cool about this integration is that you can select what model is going to respond. So I can use the Gemini Flash model for answers quickly, thinking, or pro. So you have now capabilities to use the advanced models with your notebook LMs. And you can think of that as a key advantage. So I'm going to press submit. So as you can see, the model was able to read my note. So instead of me trying to reintegrate all of my research into Gemini app manually, I can now do that very easily with notebook LM. And it's able to give me key ideas in the whole notebook in a simple manner. Let's say I have a bunch of research I have done over the past week and I have a presentation coming up and I need to understand quickly about what my research is about or get quick refreshers. I can use Gemini to give me that context before my presentation, right? And we can see that here. It defined the key ideas in LM technology, like the core definition and mechanism, the power parameters. It also keeps your sources there. So you can click on the specific sources in Notebook LM, which is huge. And we know that whatever we're getting in this output is backed by research. So this is really important, especially for everyday users. Now I can even take this further by asking Gemini to, based on this notebook, suggest how this information could be turned into a clear presentation outline. So let's press enter. As you can see, I've got a now a presentation outline that I can use before my presentation. And it starts off with the introduction to the AI revolution, the anatomy of LLMs, how they are built, as well the life cycle from raw text to expertise, advanced capabilities, and you guys get the point. But what's really cool here, once again, is the sources. I can ensure that every single output in my Gemini that I get is backed by a reputable source that I've already validated in Notebook LM. You can see the real value of this integration. Gemini is no longer guessing based on general internet knowledge, is directly reasoning based on of my top sources. Another new cool feature that's coming out in Notebook LM is that you can now instantly structure your sources with Notebook LM data tables. For students and academics, you can think of it like this. You might have a bunch of research materials and key facts for papers and study guides. And then you want to summarize all that information in a clean data table. So you can have it as event name, like historical event one, two, and then what country occurred, dates, key figures, political consequences. So all of your information is synthesized in a data table that's clear and easy to understand. 
regular users or consumers, you can also use this feature to plan travel or compare products. And you can pull all that detail from blogs and guides and summarize all that information in a simple data table that gets all the information in one place and is easy to understand. For knowledge workers, you can compare your competitors, see what they're doing, what projects they are. You can do M&A analysis all in one place. For scientific researchers, you can synthesize your findings and compile your reviews, extracting structured outcomes from papers. For example, you can see here, you can have all your trials here. You can see the method that they use, the sample size, primary outcome. So you can see how powerful this feature is. What's important here is not the table itself, it's the direction. Notebook LM is moving beyond reading and summarizing and into structured analysis and output. Now let's get into one of the most impressive features, generating slide decks directly from deep research. When you create slides in Notebook LM, you're combining Gemini's visual intelligence with Notebook LM's creative agents that understand narrative and structure. The result is not just visually appealing slides, it is visual storytelling grounded in research that you have already validated. To give you guys an example, you can see that you can convert your deep research into slides. So your dense research reports often are not going to be visually appealing. Notebook LM kind of solves that by converting your research into custom slide decks. So the prompt here was that in New Year's celebration around the world, blend magical whimsical elements with celebratory festival scenes, respect local architecture and style. So that was the prompt that was given. And you can see the slides that were created. These are direct slides from Notebook LM without any customization. And you can see that these are not only professional, but visually appealing. And they provide a bunch of context and summarize the information in a really simple manner that's easy for people to understand. Like the flowcharts we see here, how all of this flows together, like fortune, what does it mean in this culture, connection. So you can see how important this feature is because of this ability to generate something so beautiful like this. Another extremely practical use case is creating slides from rough notes. Instead of spending time formatting or aligning elements, you can upload messy notes or a rough draft and let Notebook LM handle the structure and visuals. So the prompt is that make the slides much more pretty and fun. Christmas theme. So you can see that the input slides were very simple. It was just a list format and the output image is much better and much more visual as well, much more appealing to the audience. This is especially useful when you are short on time and just need something clean and presentable. Notebook LM is also not limited to serious research. It can also be used for structured creativity. In this example, Notebook LM uses a notebook to generate visual pitch decks for a holiday themed Jane Austen's fan fiction. What makes this work is that creativity is grounded in real source material, which keeps everything coherent. So the prompt that was given was that briefly list any Christmas or New Year's events mentioned in the novels, three novella concepts based on these materials for each outline, the plot and its connection to the original book. So you can see that the production of this is pretty good. The Mansfield Ball, the Hartfield Christmas, a Captain Meriton. So you can see it's taking all the information and provides the audience with a visual information that's not only good to look at, but also very informational. Notebook LM can also refine existing presentations using brand guidelines. If you upload a brand book, Notebook LM applies colors, tone, and layout consistently across the entire deck. Prompt that was given was create a branded deck summarizing 2025 launches. Use the brand book for branding and styling references. These are all the features that Notebook LM launch and all the output that you see matches the brand of Notebook LM. And you can see it's visually appealing and you don't have to like manually make tweaks like that. So this is where Notebook LM starts to feel enterprise ready and is not just for researchers. In summary, Notebook LM is evolving from a research assistant into a full research to creation engine. Gemini 3 is what enables that shift, bringing stronger reasoning, better structure, and genuinely useful outputs. Notebook LM is becoming the memory, and Gemini is becoming the mind. Instead of just helping you understand information, these tools now help you turn that understanding into something tangible. If you want a deeper dive into one specific workflow, whether that's slides, Gemini integration, or structured research, let me know and I'll break it down step by step. If you enjoyed this video, this is what we do here. Fast, clear updates on the biggest moves in AI. If you want to stay ahead of everything happening in this space, make sure you're subscribed. And if you want the hands-on side, demos, tools, workflows, and everything developers can actually build with, check out the world of AI. We also run a simple no noise newsletter that gives you the most important AI tools and updates in just a couple of minutes. Subscribe here, follow World of AI, join the newsletter, and I'll see you in the next one.